So as the press tour for Avengers Infinity War is kicking off, a few certain outlets are allowed to see portions of the movie. Now of course they're not being allowed to see the entire thing, but closer to 30 to 40 minutes of footage. So Digital Spy Film actually reports that they got to see 30 minutes of it. And while they can't say too much, they can say that the film is very ambitious. And that there is a tonal switch between the different groups. Of course the Guardians, who see sequences are in space and very different they look and feel different and the soundtrack is very different to the scenes in New York City and in the footage they saw they confirmed that yes there is no Hawkeye in the film so there we go um honestly you know it's not too much to go by because it's only 30 minutes but what they say seems like it's pretty much I think what a lot of people expected there is going to be tonal shifts because they have to bring everything together so the easiest way to do is of course have Thor pair up with the Guardians and do that mission since he's already more cosmic and way funnier in his last outing and Guardians are a little bit more comedic then on New York you have the standard Avengers fair and in between you're trying to bridge everything with the Guardians kind of meeting them and then Thanos and then of course they talk about the ambition which you know that's the big word here we knew that this movie would be ambitious we just kind of have no idea how ambitious it is and just from the sound you know from the look of what we've gotten you kind of get this idea that this if it works you know the Russo brothers are going to be something special in Hollywood and everybody's gonna want them much like when Joss Whedon was told by everybody you can't make the Avengers work and he did on the other hand maybe this is too much we don't know because they are not allowed to review it yet but hey we're gonna find out sooner rather than later how this film ends up being in the long run